just woke up about half an hour ago. It, if You might be able to hear the diesel heater running in the background. I have it on high and you know I set it on high for about 25 to 30 minutes. Just something of something that I've, that I've done because uh, apparently it's good for it. it. It burns off any any uh, soot that any soot build up and then I drop it down to around 20. Right now it's actually almost uncomfortably hot, slightly uncomfortably hot, which is I'm okay with because it's early morning. Um, I uh, slept last night, it felt pretty good. The new bed system that I have here that I made um, is I think out of, out of 10, it's a solid 7.5. Uh, there's a few things that I need to do. I need to adjust it so that it gets wider. Right now, it's just one particular size and it would be great if it was a bit wider. So uh, overall, uh, my sleep was about, it's about eight out of 10. I woke up a couple of times last night. Uh, there was, there was a dog. <laughs> there was a dog barking. I don't know what that was about. And um, and also, I think something crawled up on my roof. I'm guessing it's maybe it's a raccoon. Even though I think it was a little cold. It was it was cold last night. It was cold this morning. Um, some things to um, to consider when um, I guess I guess going back. Uh, uh, right now, I think I have I have about three inches of of. Um, foam and it's a foam that you buy at like it's, it's not expensive it's not it's not memory foam it's just regular foam camping foam and I bought it at uh, at a Walmart it was I think about 25 or 30 dollars and in retrospect I'm thinking I think I should make it four inches uh, that way uh, it, it'll be taller okay and you know I, you can see I, I don't have a lot of headroom but I'm not a really tall guy but I can also compensate by making the bed uh, lower to the ground so that you know you get that you get that uh, top and height so uh, that's one thing about the bed um, sleep is phenomenally important sleep is important because it's good for your mood good for your mind obviously good for your body but there's also chemical things that happen when when uh, you don't sleep you, you build up a lot of cortisol cortisol is the stress hormone that uh, that controls a lot of the mechanisms that happen in your body if you have too much of that you start to break down and it's, it's, it's a very it's a very unhealthy thing to have so uh, 7.5 isn't a great score for me in terms of sleep um, obviously I want 100% sleep 10 out of 10 but I've you know I've gone about I've gone about five hours six hours of sleep it depends um, you know what's weird is I actually sleep better this may sound weird. I sleep better in my van than an actual bed. So, um, and, and also the fact is, you know, it's 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 still a work in progress. But I still sleep much more soundly. I think I think there's just something about the 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 the, the size, or maybe the, the, the just the dimensions of itself. So uh, that's something you know, I'm, I'm thinking about right now. Um, Oh yes, uh, I, I added some more aesthetics to this van. This thing here, to right there, uh, added some leads. I'm just trying something out. In in the past few videos, you've probably seen me sort of like really, um, you know, try to make this thing a little much much cozier, much much homier. Like for example, just like leaning against this this curtain here, you know, make you know making use of that curtain, a lighter curtain. So I added that curtain at the back. And I added those lights, and let me tell you something. It makes a difference. It just makes a much more homier feel, and it, it feels good. It feels good when I'm when I'm doing some computing here. Uh, it helps out a lot. So uh, one of the things I want to do is on the other side, uh, on that side, you're not seeing it in the video, is pretty much a mishmash of storage, and I want to clean that up. And so I'm going to work on something today do that I'm not going to videotape it uh, uh, just because you know, I, I don't have a lot of time today I've got a lot of things to do but once it's done I'll I'll, I'll, uh, I'll show it to you guys um, I am looking at making a table at the side here uh, one problem is I noticed that uh, 
I had to figure out a way to mount that table onto the door and uh, I don't know enough about the mechanisms of that door so I'm not sure if I'm going to screw into it or maybe glue into it so and that's another thing about when you're building for a van like this one here is my my build is permanent it's not a temporary build or a no build I did start with a no build initially because well I didn't have much of a choice so <laughs> so no build but then over time uh, my circumstances change I was able to access things and then I, I came up to this and now my Things have gotten better in many, many ways, so um, I'm very happy and very grateful for that. So now, my next step is to just um, uh, polish and make it, I guess, more aesthetic, a little prettier, and I'm hoping you guys are enjoying it, enjoying that. Uh, it, it doesn't detract from my original purpose for this minivan, and that's obviously to have a place to stay after a uh, trail run or even just even at work during my lunch I have a place to, to have a nap and just to relax and just decompress and in my case here right now I'm you know just uh, woke up and slept in the van last night and here I am just chilling out and just uh, uh, in my fortress of solitude and that's something that uh, one of my friends Chuck had had reminded me of and it came from a movie called Superman so Chuck thank you very much for that um, aside from that um, I just wanted to chime in and let you know um, I appreciate your support and you know if you like the video please like the video um, I'm hoping to add some more you know relevant content uh, if you have any questions uh, you know, please ask them and maybe I'll make a video of it like I know one of the questions I got was how I got this part here on my on my van and I know in the previous video I did show how that's done but I didn't make an official video so I'm approaching about uh, 60 or 62 videos so far on my channel my goal is for this year with that one year one year is to have a hundred videos and you know just to get a hundred videos and obviously um, along with that you know if I can get a thousand subscribers that'd be fantastic but you know that's not really neither here nor there like uh, if I can get it great if I don't that's great too uh, I'm interested in just documenting all this it's sort of like my other journey I have a fitness journey and um, I documented that and when I look back I'm thinking wow I did all that and that's what I want to be able to say to this is wow I did all that my van build is very different from when it first started and I think I don't think it'll ever finish but when it sort of does finish I think it'll be different as well so and I, and I hope you guys enjoy the little journey that I'm on. Okay, I think I'm done. And I think I already said, if you like the video, please like it, right? Subscribe. And I guess just at this point, I'm going to cue the music. Mm -hmm.